time for a little fresh sugo with pancetta. Let's get started with our ingredients. We've got pancetta, which is like bacon. We've got garlic and fresh tomatoes, which we'll be making our own sugo sauce with. Start out by boiling four to five tomatoes. This is going to be our puree when we're done. So we'll go ahead and get our pasta started while we're getting our sugo and our pancetta ready for our spaghetti. Okay, now that our tomatoes are done, we're gonna go ahead and get our puree done. This is gonna create our sugo, our sauce for us. I prefer fresh sugo rather than buying canned tomatoes. I think it's better um, to boil your own and create your own for a more fresh sauce. So now let's go ahead and add two tablespoons of olive oil. Let me turn this down. We should be at a medium heat when we're doing this. Next, let's add the pancetta in. We want to cook it down, brown it good because it is almost like, somewhat like a bacon. So we're going to cook it and brown it. Let's go ahead now and add in the garlic. I love garlic, it gives food such a great flavor. Next, we'll go ahead and uh, add in our onions. Just lightly brown these down as well. They just stir around really good. add in a pinch of chili pepper seeds. Okay, so here's where we're gonna go ahead and put in our fresh sugo sauce that we made with our tomatoes. This is all coming together so nicely. It smells really great and it tastes wonderful. And now let's go ahead and start adding our cooked pasta to the sugo. So prep time for this whole meal right here was basically about 20, 25 minutes. Super easy. Uh, it's something that can be done quickly after work for lunch. Um, it's a great meal and the flavor is unbelievable. So here we go. Let's try it out. I'm gonna go ahead and put some fresh Parmesan cheese on mine. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Enjoy.